small little test today. I've ordered some of this clear cast from Easy Composites. Um, clear epoxy surface resin. Now it's a surface resin, so I have no idea if this is going to work. Um, it's the one that's used for the pennies you see in the penny video. I'm going to I'm going to pour um, just resin with colour. And then I'm just going to pour this little one with resin and wood. It's two to one in weight. Uh, that's the hardener and that's the resin. So it's two, two parts of the resin and one part of the hardener. Um, I'm not going to do too much more explaining. I'm just going to pour it and we'll have a look at it. and We want to get it turned. Um, so anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and do this, mix this up. This resin is cheaper than my normal resin by about £30 for a 5 kilogram. I might I might be slightly wrong but I'll confirm all the prices when, when I put it uh, down in the description probably. Right, I'm just going to pour it now. And I'll do, let's get it in the pressure chamber. Okay, that's them um, demolded, these ones. Like I say, no idea if they're going to work. I think the first thing for me to go off and do is to try cutting them and drilling them. And we'll get the answer straight away from that. Um, I have to demold this one still.
Ne, dön. Right, let's go and see if we can cut these up. This one's so good, it didn't shatter or anything. We go at the second one. Right, I'll go away and drill these. Let's get them on the lathe and see what they turn like. Okay, that's it all drilled out and set in between um, the bushes. Um, I'm going to turn this the same way as I would turn the Illumilite ones and the other epoxy ones just to see. I've not rounded off any of the edges neither um, so we'll see how we get on with that. So let's go. I just wanted to show you this before I went any further. The shine on this stuff is amazing. I'm not quite sure how well you can see it in there. I'll try taking the camera down a little bit. It's a really deep shine that's on it. I'm going to put some polish on it now. I'll do that while I've got the camera down this far. Um, I just use these Nova ones. Um, I've had these for quite a long time actually. So you can on this blank here. You can actually see the tube through it. I didn't put the colour thick enough but in all honesty I wasn't too bothered because it was more I wanted to more test out the resin. This is the first, this just removes hard scratches but there isn't actually really any scratches on there but I'll go through them. Go down to the second one now. Stop that.
the third part of this is just actually uh, a spray and it's plastic shiner. I actually bought, first bought this for taking scratches out of CDs many years ago. It didn't work for that. <laughs> What an amazing shine on that. Okay, I'm going to go and I'm going to time lapse through the whole of the wooden one and I'll come back at the end when I've assembled the pens and I'll give you my rundown then.
Okay, that's them both completed. Um, they turned like aluminite turns. There is a slight odour of it. I wasn't too bothered by it. It was fine. I wear a mask making these anyway, so um, it makes no difference. It's certainly, you know, not overpowering or anything like that. Um, right, I'll show you the wood one first. Now, I finished that with a CA finish, so, you know, it was always going to have a, a high gloss on it anyway because, you know, well, CA finish tends to. Um, so, sorry, trying to keep that in the camera. So, yeah, that was a CA finish. Um, I think it was five coats of thin I did, sanded in between, and then six coats of uh, medium now here is the other one here i'm absolutely delighted with the way that's come out i honestly think it's my highest shining epoxy without anything else on it apart from you know the the micro mesh and um using the polishes after i think it shines better than my other ones Oh, let's get it back. Now you can see the tube through on this one. wasn't too worried. It actually looks fine with it. The gold sort of reflects off the other two colours and looks quite nice. I'm quite happy with that. I shall um, put some. Shall I put some pictures up after? No, I don't think I will. I think I've probably got it clear enough on this um, to see. It was just a test. So this was for the. Easy Composites Epoxy. We'll definitely be ordering more of this. In fact, I'm off to order two kilogram. It is cheaper. I think I worked it out to be about £89 for five kilograms. And that's with, um, I think it might be free postage on that. I'll put the links down below to it all. Um, Anyway, that's these two pens done and uh, hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you did, give me the thumbs up. If you didn't, give me the thumbs down. And thanks very much for watching. Any comments, leave them below for me.